What's going on, nerd tubers and geek viewers of the world? Mr. Dark Phoenix here to bring you guys the review of the premiere of the Inhumans. If this is the first time you guys are catching my channel, please hit subscribe. We talk about Marvel, DC, Rick and Morty, Game of Thrones, and all that fun stuff. And I also stream myself playing games on twitch.tv slash Mr. Dark Phoenix. More links right here down below. I'm just going to cover both episodes in this video. So if you haven't seen it, come back when you have. And if you have seen it, let's jump right on into the two-hour premiere of Inhumans. I almost slipped and said Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Behold the Inhumans and those who would destroy us. Because Ramsey always got to rule something. Ramsey's never happy. Like, we got, we, got, we got the Inhuman royal family. We got Gorgon and we got Medusa, Black Bolt, Crystal. All good. Ramsey comes in, he's all like, we should go to Earth, because why the fuck not? Plot. And then they he starts picking them off one by one. And the part that hurt me the most was when he was when they barbered Medusa's hair. Like, that's Medusa's whole shtick. Her inhuman powers is to whip her hair back and forth. Now you can't invite Medusa to the metal show anymore. Because who else going Nathan, like Nathan from my fucking uh, Metalocalypse, who going to whip their hair to the metal and shit? That part hurt me. I'm not going to lie to y'all. That shit was hurtful. Everything else is happening. Lockjaw teleports the rest of them out of Adelaide except for Crystal. So she's stuck. We pretty much... It's pretty much all typical storytelling. It's like Crystal's our remaining piece to the Adlan puzzle, and then the warrior chick that was with Ramsey goes to Earth to fight Medusa and fails, although Medusa should have just kept stabbing, but whatever. Again, plot. Now that girl is on Earth, and she's our connection to Adlan and Earth, so we pretty much have reasons to go back and forth between Adlan and now Earth. They're in Hawaii. So, you know, for once, a some kind of alien catastrophe does not happen in New York. Really happy about that. The only thing I'm not getting from this is how they're going to have it make sense that they're going to be separated for so long. Granted, this is only eight episodes, including this two-night premiere, so now there's only six episodes left. So, hopefully the story picks up a little bit, because we don't got time like that. Which is good, because... You know, I'm not really sure why people were bashing on it. Like, I heard the reviews, and I was like, I'm still going to give it a shot. Because it's a mini-series, and, you know, I don't let other reviews sway me. Granted, this story started out a little slow, and I guess, granted, people are still mad it's not a movie. But, at the same time, I'm not sure why it got destroyed in reviews so quickly. It's only the first two episodes. Like... If this were a Netflix series where they dropped it all at once and you binge watched all of it and then hated it, then I'd be fine with it. But it's only two episodes. But so far, I'm enjoying it. The only thing I'm not going to be liking is them being so separate. And then them probably not coming together till episode, like, five or six. And I hope we don't have to wait that long. I'm curious to see what their stories are going to be. Mostly it's looking like a cat and mouse game of like running away and espionage and trying to stay hidden and stuff like that. Medusa has no powers. Her hair was her whole shtick. So I'm really scared for her. But we're going to find out what happened. Did you guys see the Inhumans? What did you think about it? Comment down below. Let me know. Do not forget. Um, next week is uh, other shows are starting like Lucifer and all the other stuff. I still review Gotham and all types of other shows. I'll be reviewing all the new TV shows as soon as they come out. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button for the Gifted and Arrow and Supergirl, Legends, uh, Lucifer, Gotham, all that fun stuff. I love you guys so much. What kind of things are you looking forward to to Inhumans? Are you glad that it's an eight episode miniseries or would you rather it be a movie? Sound off in these comments down below. I love you guys. Do not forget that I love you all for all your constant support and also don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, comment, rate, subscribe to their awesome nerdy friends and always remember that through good times and bad times, remember to geek out and enjoy your lives and I'll catch you guys next time for another great video.